Welcome to the College Investor Audio Show, where we talk about the biggest issues impacting millennial money, from student loan debt to side hustles to building wealth. We will show you how to get out of debt so that you can build real wealth for the future. For years, Jackson Hewitt has been making tax filing easy and accessible through its Walmart store locations. You've probably seen them lots of times while checking out. However, the company's online filing isn't nearly as simple as filing through a Walmart. This year? Well, more of the same. Most users should pass on Jackson Hewitt Online. And here's why. On today's College Investor Audio Show. Welcome. Jackson Hewitt Online, is it really free? Ah, uh, well, it used to be. But they cut out the free option this year. All users will pay 49 bucks for federal and state filing and 25 bucks for federal-only filing. One interesting twist is that the $49 option includes unlimited state returns. If you work in several states, well, that's a great deal for you. Here's what's new in 2021. This year, Jackson Hewitt's big change is related to the pricing structure. All users are paying $49 for state and federal filing and $25 for federal-only filing, as we just mentioned. The user interface also boasts a few new tweaks, which make it somewhat easier to navigate. One thing that Jackson Hewitt Online hasn't changed is its separation of brands. For the most part, Jackson Hewitt's retail for, or in-person brand, I should say, operates separately from the online brand. Jackson Hewitt's Tax Pro from Home option is advertised through its more traditional channels. Let's take a look at Jackson Hewitt's online navigation. It appears to use a white-labeled version of tax software issued by Drake Tax Software. That means it's really just the more expensive version of 1040.com. Overall, the software offers an intuitive and easy-to-use navigation experience. It combines simple questions and drop-down menus to help you file efficiently. However, landlords are going to struggle with this software because you'll have to manually add a Schedule E through the search button to enter rental income. This makes it a poor choice for users with rental income. Ease of use. While Jackson Hewitt Online offers simple navigation, it's not particularly easy to use. It offers no obvious way to upload W-2 forms, though the website claims this is only for particular users. It also doesn't offer the option to upload last year's taxes for the sake of comparison. You know, perhaps this is a function that is expected later in the season, but kind of disappointed to not actually get what is advertised. Users should also note that 1040.com does not advertise this functionality. Aside from the requirement to enter all information yourself, the tax software is fairly easy to use. The inputs required for depreciation calculators for business assets or other complex tax things were easy to understand. However, everything related to rental properties had to be done by hand, which is quite cumbersome, to say the least. Taking a look at the knowledge articles that they have, Jackson Hewitt Online has a great set of resources on its primary webpage. These resources include a document prep list or various tax calculators. Within the tax filing software itself, resources are much more limited, though. Users can find a few FAQ knowledge articles, and additionally, the Tell Me More button sprinkled throughout the software offers some useful translations for people who aren't tax-minded. The online extras? Really nothing. There's not a whole lot going on here. But users can access customer service via live chat anytime you need it. The service doesn't include, does not include an audit protection guarantee or any other information. Unlike Liberty Tax Online, which offers an in-person double-check guarantee, Jackson Hewitt keeps its online presence from the in-person store locations. Not sure why. Can Jackson Hewitt Online help you with your crypto investments? Technically, yes, it does support tax filing for cryptocurrency transactions. But of course, entering this information is cumbersome, probably not a good use of your time. If you trade cryptocurrency regularly, our recommendation is to use TurboTax. Or you can use CryptoTrader.tax to generate the appropriate forms for you. A great resource to have in your back pocket. CryptoTrader.tax tax. Can you request your stimulus check? Of course, in response to COVID-19 and corresponding economic closures, Congress passed two rounds of stimulus funding. 
By mid-January, most people should have received the second round. Those who didn't get your checks for the second round might qualify for a rebate recovery credit when you file your taxes. Jackson Hewitt Online makes this super easy to request the rebate. You just simply answer questions about the money you received and Jackson Hewitt Online does the rest. How do they stack up to the competition? Although Jackson Hewitt Online offers a decent user experience, it doesn't deliver great value. Less expensive alternatives like Credit Karma Tax, free, and Tax Hawk offer better experiences at lower or free prices. We've also compared Jackson Hewitt Online to 1040.com because it's the same software, but offered at a lower price point. <laughs> of course, users seeking a premium filing experience might want to consider something like Tax Slayer, H&R Block, and TurboTax. We have charts and graphs that you can find all the comparisons to some of the different tax software at thecollegeinvestor.com in this article. Here are some final thoughts on Jackson Hewitt Online in 2021. Although it doesn't make our short list in 2021, the user interface is okay. It doesn't offer enough added value, though, to make the price worthwhile. The product needs greater differentiation to become worth considering for us. The only people who may be enticed by this are those who file in multiple states. However, 1040.com also offers multi-state filing for less. And again, it's the same software. Users looking for a bargain can look at Credit Karma Tax or Tax Hawk rather than Jackson Hewitt Online. Others might prefer a high-end software like H&R Block or TurboTax. No matter what you're seeking, we have recommendations for software based on your particular situation at thecollegeinvestor.com. Thanks again for stopping by. I really hope it was helpful, and we'll talk to you again very soon.